When conducting tracks on a printed circuit board are damaged, it is sometimes difficult to restore them. For example, it is difficult to draw a long track using a graphite glue, and only some people can solve the jumpers, especially onto narrow tracks. For these purposes, it is easier to use conductive markers, for example, the Keller marker which are specifically designed to apply conductive coatings, champings, and tracks on dielectric surfaces. The marker is easy to use. Before applying to a surface, you just need to press the tube a couple of times to mix the composition better and shake it until a clear ball painting is fed inside. Then, we apply the conductive pattern on the surface of the board. The applied layer sets solid quickly. The time of full polymerization at room temperature is 5 to 10 hours. But it's better to warm it with a hair dryer, for example, as the dryer drying time reduces to 2 minutes and the resistance decreases. The marker is easy to apply and may be easily removed with any solvent or using a knife if necessary. The resistivity of the composition is 2 micro ohms to centimeter and the resistivity 1 to 1 millimeter is equal to 0. It doesn't change until the temperature reaches 90 degrees Celsius. So the marker is widely used in bolt molding, which means to improve the performance of video cards and motherboards by increasing the power supply voltage. For this purpose, the marker is applied to certain resistors to change their resistance. The marker can also be used to restore contact pads of keyboards or joysticks, for example. Thus, the conductive marker may become indispensable not only for radio amateurs, but even for gamers.